It starts with thunder. Then a warning. And before you know it, thousands of gallons of water fill the canyon. This is a North American landscape, so this could be, you could find this in Utah, Arizona, California, Colorado. This is the flash flood exhibit at the downtown aquarium in Denver, Colorado, where 2,000 gallons of water rush through the canyon in a matter of seconds, showing visitors the power of flash flooding. It was scary. It was really loud. That made me jump. If I was actually out in that, that would be horrifying. Which is exactly the point to show just how horrifying the power of flash flooding can be. Snow runoff, ice melt can cause flash floods, uh, heavy rains that encounter grounds that are already saturated uh, and can't absorb any more water, as well as heavy rains that would encounter grounds that uh, is so dry that it can't absorb the water. The flash flood display has been around as long as the aquarium itself and shows what can happen in the desert after violent thunderstorms. The rushing water and sediment can crash through the desert with the speed of a freight train. So what do you do if you encounter flash flooding? Know, know your surroundings, uh, get high, get away, uh, stay away from low-lying areas in times that, that can be a high flash flood uh, danger. Don't try to cross it, don't try to pass through uh, a river that's flooding, but take high ground. And if a flash flood warning is issued for your area, evacuate immediately if told to do so. Do not camp or park near streams or in flood prone canyons. And don't try to walk, drive, or play in flood water. For Weather Nation, I'm meteorologist Carissa Kloss.